Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. Alright everybody, with Sonic Superstars launching on all major consoles as well as the Nintendo Switch just a couple of days from now, a lot of you may be wondering since this game has a bunch of brand new features, brand new power ups, brand new playable characters and brand new enemies, will this game actually feature voice acting? Well thanks to an interview posted on CGMagOnline.com, we had that answer which comes from Takashi Izuka, head of the Sonic team himself. And here's what he had to say. When asked, how involved is the plot of Superstars? Is it simple and lighthearted or should fans expect more? And here's his response. This game is a classic series game so in staying with the tradition of these games, we are not going to have any text or voiceover to tell the story. We are going to have the characters emote and show you the story. That's something that's been happening since the Mega Drive slash Genesis games. The amazing thing is that without any text or any voice, we are going to be telling a story that anyone can understand. But there are some parts that will be interesting and this touches on one of the new characters that we haven't really spoken about much yet, Trip. She's going to be a key factor in the things that are going on in the world and we hope that people will really enjoy everything that's going on. So there you all have it. Straight from Mr. Izuka himself, Sonic Superstars will not have any voice acting whatsoever but I really don't have a problem with that because personally I don't play 2D platformers and video games in general for the voice acting of course. If a game has voice acting it's an added bonus and sometimes you need it in a game but for 2D platformers not so much all the time. And some people may say that Sega is missing out because Super Mario Bros. Wonder, another huge platformer releasing the same week as Sonic Superstars, has voice acting. I mean tons of it. It's all over the place. So I mean it works for Mario but Mario has been talking for a very long time. Sonic not so much in these 2D games so it is what it is. With that being said guys, that's going to do it for this video and please make sure to like, share and subscribe and as always remember to keep it locked here at Around the Clock where here we focus on Nintendo news content around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next video.